The first films that were shown, and this dates from about 1895, uh, these were sh very short films. D.W. Griffith, I believe it was, uh, called it the laboring man's university. Everyday people can have access to unmediated, unmoderated ideas, uh, images, impulses, and they're frightened people. As soon as they told stories, people started thinking about censoring them. The battle began with first to see a woman's ass, then tits, then vagina, then a man's ass, then a man's dick, and then fucking. Anything that restrains or restricts or prohibits freedom of expression. And that includes things like the state boards of censorship like the one in Maryland. I do remember the seal though so vividly. I can still see that seal. In Maryland, defining what is or isn't obscene, and it applies to movies, is the job of an official censorship board. Charles Gibson has a report on one board member, a very outspoken 70-year-old grandmother. But regardless if anybody says my constitutional rights, big deal, constitutional right. When that was written, how many were people were in, in existence? Did they have this type of, these type of films that were being shown? His organ was showing. It must have been eight inches long. We had a cut that. Now, Sigmund Freud would say, cut that? Snip, snip on the penis? Yes. Yes, that's what my mother was doing. Sigmund Sicky. Now, Sicky's making films. 